Hello and welcome to everyone in my second tutorial of uh, how to make custom own theme for Windows 7. Uh, this is uh, part 2 if you miss my part 1 the link is in the description below and don't forget that all links to softwares and credits are in this description below too so check that out and for this part I have uh, to show you how to work in uh, Vista Style Builder and where you can download a complete grid uh, to team building and blade base from Mr. Grimm. So let's start. Okay, I'm starting with complete uh, tutorial uh, to team building and here is the link to WSB tutorial in PDF file. Uh, you have to make registration on Megateamer if you want to download this file. Okay, also you need to make a 10 posts if you want to start the downloading. So here's here's the link uh, you can see. Okay, uh, after you download a complete uh, tutorial to team building, you can open it and it's gonna look like this. Okay, I will not start yet. I have to show you a uh, few things. After that, uh, you have to download Vista Style Builder. Uh, without this program, you can't uh, make your custom theme. Uh, you need to have this software, and here is the link to download it. And this software is not for free. Uh, I think that you can have this like trial version. Also, you should check this link. Um, Okay, next uh, we have Restorator. You can download this too. I will show you in next tutorial how to use it. Uh, for this tutorial, it's not needed, but also it's very usable software. So I suggest you to download this too. And finally, we have Blade Base. Uh, Blade Base is custom um, custom. MS style. Uh, this is Windows uh, Visual Windows Visual Style file, and you need to have this. Okay, here is the link to this Blade Base. Uh, you need to download this one. Okay. Uh, also, you need to make a registration on Virtual Customs if you want to download this file. Okay. After you download everything and install Vista Style Builder, uh, you can open uh, Vista Style Builder and you'll have something like this. Uh, actually, you'll have a same like me. And now go to open and choose a second option open an existing visual style. Click on that, go and find Blade Base folder, open it. And then find this file, uh, MS Styles. Uh, this is Windows Visual Style file. Click Open. And now you can see uh, you have a lot of, of lo locations in this uh, software. And probably you don't know where to start. Uh, so there is a complete uh, team building tutorial. In PDF file so I will give you an example of how you can uh, change some image in Vista style style builder okay I will take this for example uh, Explorer and shells open a window style builder go to Explorer and shell go back uh, open Explorer location and now open command model. Now here's the number one, and it says that you need to edit image. So click on number one, and you will see a image. Okay. Now if you want to edit this image, or if you wanna uh, try to put your own image, you can click on edit and set up a software. Uh, which you are using to 
make images that could be Photoshop or paint whatever uh, click on edit and choose a uh, software or you can just go to export option and export this image just click on save that's it and now uh, you can see that I have this image on my desktop you can go to right click and go to open with Photoshop also when you are done with editing this image uh, also don't forget that uh, size of image must be same and format of image must be in PNG file so type of file is in PNG and must stay in PNG so now you have your own custom uh, image click on import uh, find your image uh, selected image click open and you can test and see how it's look like I'm just giving you a, an example uh, how you will work uh, I need to say that Vista style builder can't recognize start button uh, images for backward and forward and which the style builder can't recognize uh, image in left side panel so you need to do uh, this uh, later I will show you too uh, I will show you how to replace all these images in my next tutorials also you have one more image in control panel so this is the image that Vista style builder can't recognize okay you are done with testing you can click on stop so now uh, you can see that you have a lot of locations in Vista style builder you need to change all of them if you want to create a perfect team you need to take a uh, good time to make it uh, you see that you have a 55 page of this tutorial also you have an image that is showing which a uh, font which image uh, which text you are editing in software and that is really great so here uh, you have number one number one is is this image here uh, excuse me so this is number one image here uh, you can see that in uh, in PDF file of complete tutorial and that number one image is located here so now you need, you need to open Vista style builder and find that location click on export or edit uh, and then you can edit uh, this image on your way click on import and import your custom image when you are done all these applications uh, locations excuse me uh, when you are done all these uh, locations just go to save and click on save don't change uh, this click on save and click no okay so let's say that we are done with editing a uh, custom custom theme so we have custom theme here uh, you can copy this and go to computer local disk C windows resources themes and paste it here okay you are pasted uh, your custom theme and you can apply it so let's say that this is your theme but uh, still uh, you have to change uh, start button right you need to uh, change uh, backward and forward buttons and you need to change uh, left side images okay uh, in next tutorial I will show you how to do that okay uh, you can see this folder you have a cursors explore exe explorer frame dot dll fonts images shell shell 32 and sound schemes also you have a logo of your custom team 
So uh, if you're a beginner, I suggest you to start in Vista Style Builder and that's it. So after you download Vista Style Builder, install it, open and start making your custom images for your custom team. Uh, with the time you will learn a lot, like me. Yeah, yeah, I know uh, it's gonna take us uh, some time to change all these locations, but it's not so hard. Uh, I think that this is it. Uh, this is it for this tutorial. How to make a custom team? But don't forget that we are not done yet. I have. Uh, some tutorials uh, to show you they will be uploaded too so be sure to check that out and don't forget that all links and credits are in the description below so everything I show it in video can be downloaded from the description below uh, thank you for watching this tutorial uh, and see you next time bye